December 29th, I'm Mark Kelly with your news to go. So a heads up for folks in Boynton Beach. If you notice a different taste, maybe a different smell in your tap water starting in January, that's because the city is doing a chlorine treatment. It's set to happen January 6th through the 26th. So if you don't like that taste or that smell, they're saying you can leave the water in your refrigerator for a few hours and that allows the chlorine to dissipate. Now, if you have special water needs, maybe you use a home dialysis system or you own a tropical fish tank, they're saying you should seek professional advice for removing the chlorine properly. And the countdown is on for the special election in Palm Beach County. So January 11th is the day you're going to go cast that vote for the U.S. House of Rep District 20 seat and this special Democratic primary for State Rep District 88 seat. The deadline, though, to request your mail in ballot is coming up in just a few days. It's Saturday, January 1st is your last opportunity. The Supervisor of Elections main office will be open on Saturday from 830 in the morning until five in the evening. Now you can also request a mail in a ballot in person online or by phone. But keep in mind, if you miss the deadline, you can request and pick up a mail in ballot in person on January 10th as well. I love this story. So Santa's secret helper brought a lot of cheer to a little boy in our state Christmas Day. This is five year old Dawson Chatham thought his gifts were lost forever for Christmas, but a good Samaritan wasn't going to let that happen. So here's the backstory. Christmas Eve, his mother saw the bag of gifts was completely gone. Turns out it fell off the bed of their pickup while she was driving down the road. Well, someone ended up seeing the bag on the road. They realized what was inside all those gifts and they gave it over to the sheriff's department. That was the first good deed there. Deputies then went on social media and it just took them a few hours. And guess what? They found Austin and they made sure he got all of his gifts for Christmas. Love that, Brooke. Oh my gosh, look how happy Austin must have felt when he saw all his toys. And here's what we're looking at for today. Beautiful on your Wednesday. Look for 80s in the forecast. Plenty of sunshine to go around. No umbrella necessary. We're not expecting to see any rain today or through the end of the year.